Well, changes are coming to Monroe that will not only boost local business, but increase safety across the city. NBC 10's Brian Briggs brings us the details from the latest Monroe City briefing. And Brian, what are they discussing? Well, Bodie, today Mayor Mayo talked about everything from EMT and fire upgrades to infrastructure upgrades coming to a busy area in Monroe. Two FEMA grants would help pay for EMT training and purchasing of portable radios for fire personnel. There are also changes coming to the city's emergency response vehicle fleet. In addition, infrastructure improvements will be coming to the water and sewer system on Fulton Drive and improvements to the intersection of Bienville and Tower Drive. This will fund at least 10 students to go through the paramedic training and we can get them out on the trucks and spread them out across the job. So this would just allow us to be able to have the proper equipment for our firefighters to be able to go out and safely do their job, communicate back with the IC if needed. Um, and it's just more of a safety concern. It's going to be about 750 feet of 12-inch water main and about 750 feet of an 8-inch sewer main. The intersection meets the warrants both for traffic count and for number of crashes to look at possibly putting a traffic signal in there. The FEMA grants will go before the City Council during tomorrow night's meeting. Live in the studio, Brian Briggs, NBC 10, your local news leader.